Today at Secret Super Chef we have a unique mutton trotter recipe called as Malai Paya. Mutton trotters cooked in creamy nutty gravy that I'm sure you all will love it. Let's begin with the recipe. Place the clean cut washed mutton trotters in a pressure cooker. Add 2 tablespoons ginger garlic paste. To it add 1 teaspoon salt, 1 to 2 green chilies. I'm adding 1 4 teaspoon turmeric powder. To this I'm going to add 1 and a half cups of water. Just adding enough water to boil the trotters. Close the lid, apply the whistle and pressure cook for 4 whistles or till the trotters are cooked thoroughly. After the fourth whistle, close the stove and let the pressure release on its own. You'll notice that the trotters have cooked thoroughly. If the trotters are still not done, close the lid and give one more whistle. Now let's do the tampering. In a pan, take 4 tablespoon ghee. Here I've taken Nova ghee. Nova Shuddha ghee is one of the best ghee available. Do try it once. In the hot ghee, add 2 medium sliced onions. Add 4 to 5 cut green chilies. Chilies can be adjusted as per your spiciness. Once you notice our onions have turned translucent and have changed color, add watermelon seeds, that is the magas. Here I have added 4 tablespoons. Also add 15 to 20 soaked and peeled almonds. These almonds are soaked overnight and their skin is removed. Fry this for a few minutes. Now in a mixer jar add 100 grams of thick yogurt. To the yogurt add the fried onion mix. Make sure it's cool. Grind everything to a smooth paste. Do not add any water. Now let's do our final tampering. In 2 tablespoon ghee add 1 cinnamon stick. Half teaspoon black cumin seeds that is the shajira. Add 4 cloves and 4 peppercorns. To the whole spices add 2 teaspoon garlic paste. Fry the paste till the raw smell disappears. To our tampering add the onion paste. Fry on high flame for 2 minutes. Lower the flame and let it saute for another 5-10 minutes. Keep stirring in between. Adjust the salt as per your taste. Once you notice that the gravy is starting to thicken, stir it completely, lower the flame and now let's add our boiled trotters. Add all the trotters and whatever remaining stock is left. Gently stir everything together. If you notice the gravy is too thick, add very little water. I didn't feel the need to add any water in my gravy. Slowly let it simmer for 15-20 minutes. Now add 2 tablespoon cream, half teaspoon garam masala powder, 2 tablespoon chopped fresh coriander leaves. Stir everything together and let it simmer for 5 minutes. I have used thick table cream here but if you want you can use homemade malai as well. The malai trotters are ready to be served. Have them with some garma garam lachha paratha or tandoori roti. Hope you have enjoyed this video. If you like our recipes, do subscribe to our channel. Thank you.